everybody uh, we found out we needed some uh, mosquito fish in in the tub where we're growing uh, lotuses and it turned out to be a mosquito breeding ground so we're trying to catch some mosquito fish in our little lake but uh, I don't know if I'll succeed I put this trap in there mino trap yesterday we'll see what we got in there the mesh size is a bit too big for the mosquito, so only the mos biggest mosquito fish would get stuck in there if there's any in there at all. The smaller ones will be able to come in and out as they please. And we have one poor fish, which is not a mosquito fish, but a jewel cichlid. Nice try. Try again. There's nothing else. I mean, it's easier to catch mosquito fish with just a, with just a bucket. You go in the weeds and put a bucket in there. Just to take water. And you'll end up taking some mosquito fish with it. Yeah, it's a little pretty jewel cichlid, which we have here plenty of. It's got the spot and the little turquoise highlights. Okay. I'm gonna try again. Okay, after the first poor attempt, we tried a different spot, a shallow spot, and a different bait, just bread instead of fish food. And it looks like we've got something in there. Yep. There's a cichlid as well, but there could be some mosquito fish or, mos or mosquito-like fish. Nope. They're all cichlids. They're all just cichlids, I'm afraid. Another jewel. Looks like they're all jewel cichlids. Well, maybe we could use them too. They probably don't care what to eat. I mean the mosquitoes. I mean they grow too big for, for the purpose. I'd rather get mosquito fish. But all four of them are, uh, yeah you can tell they're the same from the spotting and everything. So that's five jewel cichlids in two different tries. Okay, we're trying a third time. Third time we got nothing. Nothing. Not always the charm. Empty number four. We got cichlids. Not only well yeah, we got one one mosquito fish. See the one that's pregnant? Hey, one mosquito fish for you. Yeah, these are different fish. One is could be the, the cloudy one is probably a bass. The striped striped one is the Mayan cichlid. The big one is the jewel cichlid. And the smallest one 
is our target fish. The, oops. The gambusia. Alright. Given our poor luck, given our poor luck with the trap, the mesh is probably too big. We're gonna try and just catch them with a bucket. I see them. Plenty of them in there. And usually when you bucket the water, you can catch them. Because they're not running away too quickly. Banking on their camel, that they're not very visible, and quickness. see them because they, they jump. Alright, by bucketing we got whatever, maybe about ten of them or a dozen. We're gonna let them out in the in the mosquito land. Also known as the lotus, lot, lotus tub. Mission accomplished, more or less. We've got an improvement on the technique. We're going to use some piece of a piece of bread and the bucket and see what happens. Maybe we can catch more that way. I mean, we should, in theory. In practice, I don't know. There's a lot more inside now. There's like a dozen inside already. They keep going in, but not some of them come out at the same time. If I pull it out right now, I'm, I'm sure we'll have a dozen. Or maybe even two. I'm sure we got like a couple of dozen in there now.